Republicans in Congress are trying to stop an executive order on immigration that grants work permits and delays for deportation for undocumented parents of U.S. citizens. 11 News reporter Lester Rojas tells us how the Latino community in Utah will be affected if this bill doesn't go any further. My fellow Americans. The Obama executive immigration bill allows undocumented parents of U.S. citizens and residents to put on hold their deportation, as well as requesting a three-year work permit. But when Yvette learned that her only chance to get a hairstyle license could be denied because of the new order, she felt that fear of not reaching her dream. Yvette is a single mother looking to get through life. If she's able to receive a work permit, she could go on and have a salon on her own and be a productive member of society. Which is what all these immigrants are asking for, is the opportunity to really show that they can be great members of our community and integrate completely. For undocumented parents that qualify, this executive order means that they can stop hiding and look for better opportunities of employment and education. But if the Congress votes against the bill, these people will remain in the shadows, living with fear of deportation. Living in the shadows, and a lot of people probably don't get what that means, but the fear they have to live every day from, you know, going even to, the, to drop their kids at school. It's if the bill moves forward, the U.S. Immigration Services will start the documentation process mid to late May. In Salt Lake City, Lester Rojas, 11 News. The U.S. Immigration Services estimate more, that more than 5 million immigrants would benefit from this bill. Applicants must prove they've been consistently living in the U.S. since 2010 and have no criminal record.